Welcome back everybody to Let's Play Shadow of the Colossus. In the last episode we vanquished Argus, the Minotaur. It looks like we're at the last Colossus. Can't believe it. Finally. But he said someone is going to stand in our way. What could that mean? Could it have anything to do with the people on horseback that we saw earlier? I mean, we haven't heard anything about that since. I guess we'll have to find out. I can't believe it. The last Colossus finally, old buddy. Let's find out where we have to go here. I always get stuck on this one, even though it's incredibly straightforward. <laughs> when you start out, it looks like the light actually brings you back to where you fought the very first Colossus. And actually, it's pointing directly in there. See that? So, it's kind of like, well, I can't make a mistake about that, right? But this is definitely where we fought the first Colossus, but there's nothing in here! So let's turn around. I don't even know why I showed you that. Um, so where do we go? Oh! Wait a minute. Wait, we don't go this way. Do we? I do this every single time. No, that's a wall. Nope, derp. Sorry. I do that every time. Okay. It's this way. It's to the left of the first Colossus entrance. It seems strange that you wouldn't come down here any time before since it's so close to some of the others, but... You just really don't unless you go exploring on purpose. So it's right in here. It's gonna be a not too long of a ride. I would say about a couple minutes. Not too bad. Finally the last one. I'm so excited. I have no idea where I'm gonna cut this video because it's gonna be incredibly long. So probably what I'll do is right after I beat the last Colossus I will cut it. And then we'll have the ending ending after that. We'll see what happens. And I think some of the ending cutscene glitches just a little bit. I'm so sorry about that. I tried my best to get that to not happen, so hopefully it won't mess anything up too bad. Ooh. That's very pretty out here. Some save states. We're gonna pass. We just passed one. There's gonna be another one, I believe. And there's some trees and lizards out here too, so this is your last chance to collect any fruit or any lizards that you might want to get. This will be your last chance to get them. In this playthrough, obviously. So, a really pretty open meadow. Perfect ride. Right, buddy? Well, that looks like where we want to be, right there. Onward. Oh, it's a little bright out here too. I'm getting more of that glow problem. Here we go. We won't jump the cliff, so let's go to two hawks. Look at that. Huh. Whoops. Wait, what? Oh, sorry, buddy. That's not the right way. I always get stuck on these hills. Watch, I'm probably gonna get stuck again. Yeah. It gets down here. Yeah. I would get lost on the way to the last one. No, oh, it's down this way, right? It has to be. It is. Yeah. Yeah. I know it is. Here we are. Looks like there's a pathway through those rocks. Pretty sure that's what we want. Let's go. More hawks. More cliffs. Uh, this is not the right way. <laughs> oh no. Oh, I'm sorry, sweetheart. I'm sorry. Yeah. 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 I'm the worst driver.
Here we go. Okay, this is it now. <laughs> After you get stuck on the hills like I did, like an idiot. What's that over there? Something looks bright. Let's see. I want to know. Looks like a door. Or something. But it looks closed. Yeah! Epic jump is epic! Huh. Yeah. Whoop. Sorry. I'll run you right into that. Well, at least I stopped that time. Huh. So what do we do? Well. Get out your Zelda-like stuff. And shine your sword on it. Cool, huh? You gotta admit, that was pretty Zelda-like, right? To hold up something and shine it onto a door to open it. Now, if you haven't killed all of, um, 15 Colossus before this, you cannot open the door. It will not work, even if you come over here. So we don't even try. Uh... Let me just set something up here real quick on these settings. Hey, buddy! Bye, buddy. <laughs> He's done. He's like, nope, 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 I'm done. Okay, we should be fine now. So the 15th one, the 16th I mean derp, the last, what could be in here? Hey! I didn't mean really leave. Come back. Agro, what's wrong with you? Wait, where did he go? What happened? You don't want to go in there? It's okay, buddy. Come on, we got one last one to do. Then we'll be all done. It'll be okay. Alright, so what could be in here? This looks like part part of like a um, demolished city or something like that. There's a save point right here on that rock. I suggest you use it. Yeah. You're not using save states. And when you're done with that, come up the stairs. Aggro takes stairs very well for a horse. It's good at that. Alright. There's a bridge over there, we should handle that. Whoop, I'm sorry about the glitch. Hold on. There we go. Let's go! Wait, what? There's no way that happened. What do we do? How do we even go on at this point? There's no choice. We have to go on. I don't even know what to say after that. So I'm not gonna say much. We just have to keep climbing. Otherwise everything we've done up to this point is gonna be for nothing. Wonder has a determination now if he didn't have one before. Now we have two reasons to end this and finish it up. Otherwise he's gonna lose two things that are dear to him. So let's keep climbing and see what's at the top of this tower even though we kinda have to do it begrudgingly now with a lot of sadness. Sorry about the blip. I don't know what that was. It does get a little glitchy up t um, at this last Colossus. Um, it, it's just a lot of stuff that's gonna happen up here, but I think, I think we got it. Hopefully. The climbing here is pretty straightforward. There really isn't any way you can get lost. It pretty much guides you to where you need to go. Oh my gosh, 
slash poor aggro. No matter how many times I see it, it still gets me all choked up. I don't know if there's anyone watching it that hasn't seen that before, but I wasn't gonna talk in front of that and ruin it. Wait a minute, what? It suddenly just got very dark. And very windy. And that doesn't look like a place I want to fall down, so let's not do that. What? Is that thunder? Wait, what the heck? Something's angry up here. I'm a little scared. Wait, what? What is that over there? Crap. This is it, you guys, the final Colossus. This is the Grand Gigas. Malice, also known as the Grand Celestial. He's gonna fire crazy projectiles that hurt like that and stun quite a bit of time. So you have no hope in running up to him. There's kind of two puzzles that involve us getting where we have to go for our objective. Number one is getting to him. That puzzle is gonna entail us lots of ducking, dodging, rolling, and being clever with where we go. We're gonna use these trenches to get closer. Seems like a good idea to me. These are good, the only problem is, is that you're a little vulnerable when you're climbing out because it takes a minute to do that. And he can fire one right at you as you peek up and kind of kick you back, which sucks. So I'm gonna wait right until he makes a hit like that and jump up and then hopefully get behind something really fast because he does not have a big reload time holy crap oh my god oh my god oh boy you should wait longer than me don't be as reckless as I just did that was stupid watch I'm gonna hit, hit on the way to that thing I know it ah no <laughs> whoops it's because I ran out I shouldn't have done that just fall into the holes don't try to do it without the trenches, you won't make it. He fires way too fast for that, so let's see where this takes us. Should get us a little closer. Let's see. This whole fight is really dark, so I really hope you can see enough. It's so cool how they designed it. Alright, where is this? Looks like a cliff out here. Oh, okay, it's the side. I see. Let's go around this way. Right here can be a bit of trouble because he can actually shoot you while you're standing on this- well, hanging. Like that! Hanging off this thing. That is a dick move. The blast can knock you off even though it doesn't, like, hit you per se. Hits the rock. Alright, let's not fall here. Keepers. Alright. In here, there's really nowhere else to go at this point. Let's see where this takes us. Come on, Wander. This is the big finish. We can do it. I don't like getting out of this one because it's so... Just get right behind the pillar and you should be okay. But this is the one I hate climbing up the most. No, no, no. Come on. Up, up. Not sideways. Up, up, up. Don't take time. Get right behind this thing. Alright. What? Why did I do that? Why did I do that? I, that was me. That was stupid. That was really dumb. You should wait. Don't like, take two at a time like I just tried to do. It's stupid. He'll get you 90% of the time. Unless you're really darn good about it. I just don't want this video to take a million hours. Oh! You pooper. 
He's angry. But you know what? So am I. Especially after what just happened. Now a lot of people here are attempted to run up to him from here, because since he's right there. But, um... I'm trying to show him, but it's not really working. Now you can see a little bit of him. But if you do that, he's gonna nail you. Right before you get to the stairs. Every time! And coincidentally, it pushes you down where you should be going. So, I took a hit just to show that on purpose. Yeah, we'll go with that. Haha. <laughs> Alright, let's see where this goes. Oh gosh, I can bring the whole place down. Alright, what's this? Where the heck are we? Wait, what? My god, he's huge! We're like inside of his metal skirt. Here's like his feet. They're like bolted. I don't know if you can see in here. They're kind of like bolted into the earth or into the floor per se. Those are his legs right there. And this is kind of like what? His giant stone skirt building? I don't know. I, I get what they were going for, but to me it just looks like a skirt no matter what. I don't know why. So the second part of the puzzle is we have to climb this apparatus to even get up to him. Because this is just stone and metal and stuff. Can't hurt this. And there's no exact way to get up here. You, there's a whole bunch of possibilities depending if you go left or right. You just gotta make your way around and find your way. It's not difficult, to be honest. This is not uh, the hardest Colossus by far. In fact, I think for a final boss, this one is fairly easy. It just takes time and a little bit of cleverness. And this Colossus is different from any of the other ones we've fought in the fact that, number one, he's humongous. The sheer size is really noticeable. And then, two, he's immobile. So he can't move except for the top half of him, which we'll get to in time. It's definitely not the same as having like a an animal bucking underneath you or something like that. I think maybe also maybe a third thing about this guy is he's incredibly human appearing. We'll talk about that when I get up there. If I can get up there. Wonder what are you doing? Come on, buddy. I'm just trying to find the easiest photo. Look at that. As you go up higher, it kind of zooms out a little to show you your progress. We haven't even gotten to him yet. <laughs> it's all his... skirt. <laughs> I'm just going to keep calling him skirt. There's nothing we can do about it. We can see some of his body in there, but we can't really do anything about it. It almost looks weird, though. It doesn't look the same as the other Colossus's bodies. It looks kind of, like, corrupt. Okay, here's his little skirt. Be right back one second while I mess with a setting. Sorry about the blip. Alright. Here's his first trigger point. Pretty obvious. It's huge. Oof! Pretty self-explanatory and it looks like that hurt a lot. He puts his hand back here to kind of feel around for you. And this is, this is hard for me because the camera doesn't really help you in showing where the heck you're... S I mean, you know you're supposed to jump on the hand, but when you face around, see what I'm saying? You can't see where you're going. So you can't tell if you're even jumping in the right way. Uh, okay, I didn't mean to fall. That wasn't the right thing to do. Wait till he gets close, but see... See that? See how it glitches up close to him and then you can't jump because you can't see where the heck you're going. Oh, he, he gave up. <laughs> Luckily, we can do this as many times as we need to. Alright, hopefully I won't mess it up this time. Yeah, once the camera doesn't show me where I need to go, there we go. Hang on to his hand. He's gonna bring it up. His hand is very, very humanoid. Rings, claws, not any of the other ones had nails or claws or anything. Well, other than animal claws. Trigger point! Hit this. Do not go past that bracelet. It is electrical and it will hurt you. Go to his next hand. See how he sets it up there for you? Just wait till it's close and then have a jump. There we go. This is the part where some people get tripped up. Because he's going to roll his hand all over the place and he doesn't really give you any time to rest. If your grip is looking bad at this point, stab him once in this hand. And then what he'll do is lay it flat for quite a long time so you can stand... Look at that. That is so awesome. So cool. So you can take time to rest your grip here, have a look at him to get a cool screenshot, and also you can check for vitals, because what are we supposed to do? 
A hint. Let's try it, huh? Hang on. Alright, we're making progress now. Now the shoulder is still a dangerous place because he can wiggle it a lot and there's really not too much place for the rest up here. Oh my gosh, this guy is massive. I don't know if you can tell, but look how high up we are. Can you even see it back there? We have to make our way up to his head and this thing that he wears, this collar thing, is just stone, so there's nothing to hang on to. So let's be careful. Alright, we know the drill, don't we? Pretty self-explanatory. Ooh. Prepare for the coolest angles ever fighting this guy up here. Freaking awesome. In the background, we can see all the spires lit up of all the colossi we've killed previously. All lit up against the black sky. It is so awesome. Come on now. It is possible to fall off, and if you fall off from here, you're pretty much dead. this a lot. I think we have plenty of grip. I think we're gonna be okay. Oh, one more guy. One more. That's gotta hurt. Look how humanoid his face is. It's almost creepy in a way. Like more creepy than it should be. We've got it right here. Oh. The last Colossus. Crumbling. You can kind of see his legs buckle under there, but the skirt kind of falls down and keeps him propped up in this kind of pathetic pose. Oh no! Don't fall too far, like, you can die. Whoa, no! No getting away from- wait, what? <laughs> Wander defies gravity, even in death. Okay guys, we have a lot of cutscenes, so when I come back, we'll watch the finale. What happens? See you later.